Oh my god, shirts. Um, welcome back to part 12 of Let's Play Halo 3 ODST. That is the enemy I was talking about. We now begin the fight with the Scarab. Yes, the Scarab. Oh shit! Now this is a hard fight. Mainly because you want to destroy those uh, respawners, because otherwise the scarab is going to get shield. The people on the scarab is going to get shield are going to be shielded by the engineers. <coughs> and once I've finished up destroying those respawners, I'm going to get in a new banshee because this thing's kind of dead almost. So there's a quick way of destroying this thing, and that's by kicking out its legs. I'm just going to quickly hop in this thing. Oh, Shizer! Even though my health is like really, really low. <coughs> <coughs> okay, so keep shooting its legs, and no, don't get hit by its uh, thing. Whatever you do. Okay, so now that you've uh, managed to get it down, yeah, shooting its legs makes it, makes it stop. So there it goes. It's dead already. Keep shooting at the turret if you really want. <clears throat> it's the only thing that actually lives until the scarab itself explodes. Like that. To be honest, in Halo 3, I mean actually Halo 3, the, spar the scarabs when they die, they're far more epic than that. Sure, that was the only scarab in the entire game. But really. Ah, alright. So, that's the Scarab Bug Wasted. Or Bug Terminated, I guess. Now let us head through, and... Oh yeah, this is it. This is the end of the level. <laughs> but yeah, basically, that Wraith that you saw before, the one that was actually not in, you can get in that one. So, yeah. I got in it once, so it's pretty, pretty cool, actually. Keep her steady, Mickey. You doing okay? Just glad we didn't go with your first plan. Look at those tunnels. Ones that aren't flooded are probably packed with buggers. Hell, I wouldn't go down there even if you ordered me to. Come on, Veronica. What could be more important than that carrier? My orders. And Buck? Call me Captain. Mickey, turn around. Find a safe place to set us down. What? Why? I lost something. Now I know where to find her. Clumsy buck. So yeah, summary for that level, we squashed a bug in less than a minute. <laughs> Which is actually kind of cool. Hmm. Well, it seems empty, so... Oh. <sighs> oh, well. Huh? My beacon is active. Need immediate assistance. Someone, please respond. Hmm. Alright. So this begins the actual mission where you play as the rookie. Locate entrance to city underground. This is the first mission where you play as the rookie this time. So just to just to recap this whole thing. It's the only area you get now, which is kind of funny. It's all right. Let's turn on the visor and head around. <coughs> Twilight of Man and where next? Oh my god! So, oh shit! There's a hunter over there. You can just ignore them. They won't hurt you. 
Ninja! Oh, fuck. I didn't realize you guys jumped. Okay. So, now what we need to find is we need to, ah, uh, we need to kill these guys, and we need to shoot at a bubble shield. Ah! I stuck him on the gun. How, how cool is that? Oh. How dare you? How fucking, how dare you? Okay, that's way too close to your face. I'm, I'm not even. You die. You also die. Did I miss? Yeah, I missed. You die in the face. Ha ha ha! Okay, so. You guys die, please and thank you. You, what the shit are you doing? You die. You also die, because I shot you in the balls. You die. I actually killed him, too. Oh, yeah. The thing you're looking for is... Wait, where the hell is it? Oh yeah, right. <laughs> it's over here. Wow, genius much. Um, <coughs> <coughs> uh, I don't like heights. Ooh, I hate heights. Uh, oh, hey, rope. Uh, yeah! Oh! oh, 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 oh God! I hate ropes. So as our hero descends into the depths of hell, um, a loading screen intervenes in the story. I think. This begins the mission data highs. Ah! You've got me cornered. I'm low on ammo. Ugh, a door. You can hear me. I'm on sub level nine. Use station. Okay, so we need to head to sub level nine by the looks of things, and because we need to do that. We're going to continue onwards with new intel data. Okay, so find find there on sub level nine. <coughs> Just a note here for the rest of this mission and for the rest of the next mission, and because I'm playing as the rookie, I'm going to play myself, portray myself as the rookie, as like the main cutscenes and stuff you've been seeing me do, um, just to kind of liven this up a bit more. Uh, the other characters, I don't exactly know how to portray a little bit differently because I don't really pay attention to the characters too much. I just like their sort of attitude b b towards things. But yeah, for the rest of this, because as the next two missions go on, <coughs> you play as the rookie. So I'm going to portray this as if I am the rookie and how I've been making him seem before. So... Jackass! You took my donuts! <laughs> I stuck you on the nuts. I mean, the foot thing. You're... I falcon punched you in the face. Is there anything around this corner? Doesn't look like it. Is there anything over there? No. Ah, Grunt! Oh, Grunt! I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, hey, you, have a blueberry. Ah! You also die, kinda. Yeah. You, you can't run away from me! I need a hug. No! Yay! Also, another note, I don't know if this will happen, but there is a guy that we'll meet soon. I don't know if he'll just, like, Kind of do what he usually does if you're just playing through the game, kind of like the way I am, and you don't find all the audio logs. Because I found them all, I don't know if he'll do. 
what it, what <coughs> what he normally does. But if he does, I'll show that as well. Just the location of the last data log as well. But we're kind of up for time, and there's the guy right there.